Wirtz reporting for us tonight. Well, new tonight, soon Southside Rock Hill could look a lot different. Fox 46 and South Carolina Bureau Chief Shakira Speaks shows us the incentive being offered to businesses to get them to move in. We're in a food desert. Um, no one has a grocery store within a one mile radius of where they live in the south side of town. Councilwoman Nikita Jackson is one of the council members over the south side of Rock Hill. She says the council is looking to redevelop the area with a $225 million tax infrastructure financing bond. But just having the simple pleasures of having a grocery store in our community will have a tremendous impact on people's everyday life. You don't have to ride on go over to Dave Lab Boulevard or go to Newport to go to Walmart. The council will make the South Side a TIF district, similar to Fountain Park. The TIF is created for when new development come into the area that we can help um, incentivize them by providing the infrastructure that is going to be needed for the new development that's going to come. It'll provide things like water, sewer, gutter, and sidewalks, things that could offset the cost for an incoming developer. And the tax revenue generated from any new fully operational development will in turn be used to pay off the TIF debt, costing the taxpayers nothing. We're looking to attract all types of businesses that's going to be beneficial to the community, you know, such as a, a dry cleaner. We don't have a dry cleaner over in our area. We have to go to Cherry Road or go to Helco. We're looking to in encourage a restaurant to come on our side of town. We would like to have something new and different on our side of town as well that we can enjoy. The South Side is considered the low income part of the city, but Jackson ensures that's not the mindset of the people. For years, she says the folks on the South Side have been saying there's been little economic development and growth in their area. And this is actually a community driven effort. We're now seeing where there's going to be some movement and traction. We just need for everybody to get on board and to say, hey, the South Side of Rock Hill is next.